Hi guys. Did you see something behind me? Yes, I finally got a pet aphid. And I like its golden color. Despite how good the color it is, the reduce fire and speed stat is kinda useless I know. And because it's just 1%, so I can't totally tell the difference. Apparently, you are able to feed 20 Scholar Sage to level it up. Which I will not. But there's one feature that I like most about Pet Aphid. That is they are able to follow you literally everywhere. Now that we are done with Pet Aphid. Let's try attract 10 creatures with blue flower. This flower will make you attract only uncommon and rare. I just realized while editing that I didn't capture any creature. So why did I activate green flower lol? A tiger beetle. Nothing so special. Wow, a centipede from pink pheromones. Dragonfly without rain hop. I quite surprised. Jeez, I have to wait until the night. Another centipede. And another. Are you kidding me? I got butterfly at dawn again. Not gonna lie this is so annoying. A scorpion. A butterfly at night. So this mean the time won't affect while blue flower activate. Just how many centipede will I found? Now to summarize this centipede flower. The time and weather most likely not affect the summer. Even dragonfly can be attracted without rain. And butterfly can be attracted during night time. Also I found this flower not that handy for me. Because late game player most likely use special creatures anyway. But it might be good for beginner or people who want to farm bodipots.